Hey guys, it's Fishlord here, and welcome back to the second episode, or the first really, I'm gonna call it the second episode, of the Pokemon Soul Silver Randomizer Nuzlocke. Now, in the last episode, I asked you all to basically just go ahead and choose my starter, and we actually had an amazing turnout. Like, it was really, really good. We had a total of 23 people who actually basically commented on the video, so... Thank you all so much for just all the support. And now, anyways, let's get down to business. So, in last place was Fion. And now, Fion had seven... Wait, I just want to go into here real quick. Fion had... Where's Fion? Fion had seven votes. So, as you can probably tell already, there's not many votes left. There's a total of 16 votes left. And it was actually a two-way tie between Ekans and Lanoon. So, since it is a two-way tie and I need to get this recording out for you guys, I am going to have to choose which Pokemon I am going to want. And I'm going to be choosing Ekans, just because Ekans really isn't used that much. And Lanoon, honestly, I just don't like. Also, because if you get Ekans, the rival will be Lanoon. So it's, you know, it's not that bad. It might be a terrible first rival battle, but eventually I think it should be fine, especially if we get some leveling in and stuff. So I'm going to go for Ekans. I'm going to open up the Pokeball, and voila! We now have a Ekans as the first Pokemon. And I'm going to go ahead right now, and I'm going to name it someone, uh, William Klein, said to name Ekans Voldemort. Vol I hope I don't bu uh, butcher this right now. Voldemort. I'm pretty sure that's how he spelt it. V uh, Voldemort. Wait, I want to. <laughs> I don't know if that's the correct spelling of Voldemort. I I need to go check real quick. Uh, I need to look. How do you spell Voldemort? V O L D E. Oh, it's not R. It's just D E M O R T. Volder. Voldemort. Okay, and voila. So, Ekans is going to be our starter for the series. Yes, Voldemort is the nickname I want to give him. How do you like walking with the Pokemon? It's not bad, is it? You can talk, or you can take it all the way to Mr. Pokemon's house. If your Pokemon gets hurt, you should heal with this machine. It's so easy to use. Just check the PC on my desk. Mr. Pokemon goes everywhere and finds rarities. His house is past Cherry Grove City. Go north a little past Cherry Grove. I'm counting on you, fish. All right. Well, again, I just want to stress the fact that we are not able to get our first Pokemon because, or like our first encounter in the area, because we have not gotten Pokeballs yet. So we need to get Pokeballs before we can go any further. And we're going to be talking to Ly uh, Lyra. Are you Lyra? I think you're Lyra. Yes, you're Lyra. Fish, so you picked an Ekans. That's a cute Pokemon you have. Uh, Q would not be the word that I used to describe an Ekans. Like, <laughs> that's not the word. When you walk with it, it'll become more friendly. You should turn around and talk to it sometimes, too. Oh, that's right. Why don't you show it to your mom? See ya. But I don't want to show it to my mom. Anyway, she's going to hurry off. I just sped it up because there's, there's no point in that. I'm going to speed up a little bit. And I'm going to have to go talk to mom. Oh, fish. That's a cute Pokemon you have. Again, what's with calling this Pokemon cute? It's not a cute Pokemon, it's a snake. Snakes are not cute. Professor O, my, um, per ugh. Professor L must have given it to you. Oh, Professor Elm has a task for you, you say? What kind of task? I see. That sounds a little difficult. But when someone makes that kind of request to you, it must be important. Oh, that's right, I completely forgot. Your Pokegear came back from the repair shop. Here you go. Thank you, Mom. Thanks for giving my Poke Gear. I needed that. Poke Nav, or, or Poke Gear, as it's often called, is what every trainer should have. Guess what? You can use the Poke Gear to make a phone call, too. Do you remember how? Yes, I do. Just touch on the Poke Gear and touch the telephone button. Okay, the name of the Pokemon you. Uh, okay, I got it. Alright. Anyways, I need to get going now, because I want to simply move on with this. I'm going to fast forward just so I can move a little quicker. Wait, wait one second there, little lady. Or little man. Uh, are you a ladyfish? I don't, I don't know. I almost completely forgot about this. Here, I'll give you my number. It's, it's, it's such a coincidence that he gave me the number now when I had the book of year compared to before when I didn't have the book of year. I don't know. It's just, just, a, just a big coincidence. I don't I don't really know. 
I'll call upon you if anything comes up. I'm butchering his. I'm giving him like three different voices. All right, well, I'm gonna move forward. Lyra's not gonna teach me how to. Okay. Well, Lyra's not gonna be teaching me how to apparently battle. And if I'm correct, we should. I need to. Yeah, I was gonna say I need to battle people. Ooh, Curlia. If I have Poison Sting, that, that actually is gonna be really good. I'm not sure he's he's not fairy though. All right, it's not gonna be that great. So I have Wrap, Poison Sting, and Leer. I'm gonna wrap you so you can't leave because you probably only have teleport. Wow, oh, that was a crit. Okay. Yeah, you can't you can't leave anymore. I'm sorry, Curly. You're, you're you're trapped here with me. I'm gonna be just wrapping you till the end of time. Poison Sting. He's poisonous. Well, we're gonna go for confusion. That's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt a lot. All right. He's gonna get wrapped, and one more poison sting should kill him, and it does. And again, Voldemort at this point can die. It will not really matter because the lock has not started yet. It starts once I get Pokeballs, so Voldemort could die like five times right now, and it would not really matter. Even though I would like him to not die. Ooh, star you. Okay, I don't think you have any good moves at this point. I'm gonna go for a wrap again just to keep him in there. I don't know if he's gonna flee or do whatever. I don't really want him to do anything. So he's gonna go for a tackle. It misses. That is great. That is actually really, really good. I'm gonna go ahead right now. I'm gonna go for a poison sting. If I get another poison, I'm gonna like laugh so hard. I don't think I will though. No. Tackle does one damage. Star you, you have no attack. You have actually, like, no attack right now. <clears throat> oh, sorry about that, too. My voice is... For some reason, I have something stuck in my throat, and it's not really going well. But anyways, Voldemort's gonna be level... S no! I was really hoping there that he would reach level 6, but he, he didn't. He failed me. You failed me. And the really big key in this game is you can't level up too much in the beginning. Do you have an item for me? I wanted to take a break, so I, uh, I saved to record my progress. Okay. Great for you. Alright, but yeah, the key in this game is to not over level in the beginning. Like right now, I'm level 5, so I'm able to go ahead and I'm able to kind of just grind a little bit. But you don't want to get too high level because if you are if you get too high level, it's going to be very hard to catch a Pokemon. And especially with the level 2s and such. So I have to be careful. I cannot go over level 7. Like that's, like, that's basically the rule. I cannot go over level 7. I don't, I can't collect them. Darn it. But yeah, I cannot go over level 7 because then it's going to be very hard to just simply, uh, it's going to be very hard to capture any Pokemon. It's going to be, because I'm going to be killing them all because I'm going to be so strong. So, anyways, what's this old man going to say? You're a rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell. That's okay. Everyone's a rookie at some point. If you'd like, I can teach you a few things. Okay then, follow me. Ugh. I don't want to follow you, old man. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot that you weren't wearing the running shoes. I'll try to keep. I'll try to go as slow as possible. So, try to keep up. This is the Pokemon Center. They heal your Pokemon in no time at all. They'll be relying. Or you'll be relying on them a lot. So you better learn about them. This is the Pokemart. They sell Pokeballs for catching wild Pokemon and other useful items. Yes, I'm gonna be going there a lot. I wonder if I can buy the Pokeballs right now. That'd be great. That'd be good, but not good. Um, I might not. I want to, but I don't think I will. Route 30 is out this way. Trainers will be battling their Pokemon there. If you go a little further, you'll see Mr. Pokemon's house. Alright, so thank you. Somehow he knows I'm going to be looking for Mr. Pokemon. I don't really know how he knows that, but somehow he does. This is the sea, as you can see. Some Pokemon are found only in water. Yes, like a Tentacruel. A Tentacool. You know, you barely find those outside of water. Here is my house. For your effort to keep up, uh, for your effort keeping up with me, I'm gonna give you my running shoes. They're still warm. Uh, I'm sorry, Mister, but I don't really want your running shoes. Like, sounds really appealing, but I don't really want them. Got you, didn't I? Don't worry, these are brand new. Again, how come a stranger, a, a random stranger, is just giving like me running shoes, and I don't, I don't say anything? Like, no. If someone came up to you in real life and was like, "Hey, I got shoes for you." You know, do you want them? You'd be like, no, get away from me. How do you know my shoe size? How do you know, like, like that I didn't have those shoes? Like, it's just creepy. Like, it's just really, really creepy. I don't really know. Anyways, thank you for healing my Pokemon. So now we need to head up to Mr. Pokemon. And I still can do a little bit more grinding. It's not like I can't do any at all. And there's the old man again. 
<laughs> I made it. I almost forgot about one thing. There's another token for me. Take it. The guy Jen loaded the map card on Fish's Poke Gear. And now I can show the town map. It's up to Poke Gear and okay, thank you. You'll see the map, thank you. Thank you, sir. Alright, so now I'm curious to see what the Pokemon are in Route 30. Because the, the first route did not seem to have good Pokemon. That's scary. That actually is scary. Because Voldemort, it's not really a tanky Pokemon. Luckily, I get to reduce its attack, which is very good. I'm gonna go for Ember, though. That's gonna hurt. It doesn't, doesn't do that much, but if he burns me, it's gonna be annoying. I wrapped him. That does nothing. Oh, why? I just realized. Rapidash is basically a unicorn, because it has the little horn. Like, if you look at right above its eyes, it has a horn there. I never saw that before. I actually never saw that. But anyways, I want to kill this Rapidash because it will give me hopefully a decent amount of experience. I'm hoping. Because it's, you know, it's a second evolutionary Pokemon. It should give me a decent amount of experience. If not, I'm going to be very, very sad. I'm going to need to heal up as well. It's going to be annoying. Poison Sting. I think, no, Rap's not going to kill. Rap's not going to kill. No, I have to go for one more. Ember, do not get a crit right now. Good. Because if Ember got a crit, that could have been... Very bad, but again, if, it, if Voldemort died, it wouldn't have been that bad. I just would have to do it again. 82 is actually a decent amount for this level. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go back real quick. And we're just going to heal up because there's nothing else for us to do. We need to... Ekans cannot... I don't want Ekans to be dying. I want him to try and grind on as many people as he possibly can. But we're just have to head up to Mr. Pokemon's house. That's our main goal right now. That's what we, what we need to do. So let's just go do it. I really hope, though, that we actually like, get good Pokemon in this game. Because if you don't get good Pokemon, it's very hard to do well in, in a Nuzlocke. Like, if you just get Bidoofs, it's like, ugh. A Water Stone. That's actually really nice to have. And I'm going to need to talk to this guy here. I really hate how there's so much, like, dialogue. I'm not even going to read this guy. So much dialogue before the actual game begins. Like, it's so annoying. It's really annoying. There's I'm going to need to go take this little... Apricorn right here. Just snag that. Bring me, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Uh, Apricorn guy thingy for giving me the free Apricorn. That was very kind of you. And now I need to go take uh, get this item. Rebuta Berry? What is that? What is that now? That is going to be in the berry section. Oh, it's just used for making coffins. Coffins. Okay, then. Interesting. Now, Mr. Pokemon's house is up this way. I'm gonna go in this direction. If I don't get a, I didn't get a single encounter there. Okay then. That's not. I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining at all. But yeah, my rival's gonna have a little noon, which is gonna be kind of scary. But I think we should be fine. And here is Mr. Pokemon. What 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 voice should I give him? Uh, you must be fish. If uh, it was I who sent an email to Professor Elm earlier. Oh, what are you going to give me now, bud? What are you going to give me? This is what I want Professor Elm to examine. A mysterious egg. A friend of mine from Ecrutec gave it to me. I bet you can't find this kind of egg in Yoto. I thought Professor Elm might be able to tell what this is. He's the best when it comes to po the, the research of Pokemon evolution. That's a quote from the famous Professor Oak. You're returning to Professor Elm? Here, your Pokemon should have some rest. Thank you, sir. That was very kind of you. And this right here is Professor Oak. Hey, Oak. How's it going? And with that, I'm Professor Oak, a Pokemon researcher. So, you're a fish. I was just researching, uh, I was just visiting my friend, Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand for Professor Elm, so I waited here. Oh, what's this? A rare Pokemon. Uh, Oak. An Ekans is not very rare in Kanto. <laughs> it's not rare at all. What are you saying? I see. You must be helping Professor Elm's research. I think I understand why Professor Elm gave you that Pokemon. And, um, you must treat your Pokemon with love and care, it seems. Ah, you seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? See, this is the latest version of the Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. I'd like you to have it. Alright, thank you. Go meet many kinds of Pokemon and wait you at that Pokedex. But I have stayed too long. 
I have to get to Goldenrod for my usual radio show. Fish, I have a feeling that this is not time we'll, and the last time we'll meet. Let's exchange numbers just to be on the safe side. Alright, there we go. I'm giving my phone number to just random strangers. Seems great, yeah. Alright, so now we're just going to be heading back, and we're going to have the rival battle as well. I really want to get our first encounter in this episode, though. And hey, Professor Elm, what are you calling me for? Hello? Fish? It's, it's a disaster. Oh, it's, it's just terrible. What should I do? It's... Oh, oh, oh no. Please get back here now. Alright. Alright, I'll, I'll be coming back. Don't worry. I really want to know some other encounters in this area, though. And as of course, of course, as I say that, I get a thing. It's another Rapidash. I don't want to battle you just yet because, you know, I'm not all the way through and you will actually, like, basically either take me out or do a lot of damage to me. I don't really want to, like, to deal with that at the moment. An Arcanine! Oh, that'd be great if I got you. I would love an Arcanine. That'd be, that'd be power on the house. That would actually be a lot of power. But now, is there anyone else? Is there anyone else? Please? Slugma. Or, sorry, Macargo. What, what are, what's with all those fire types in this round? In this route? Like, seriously, I've never seen this many fire types. Like, never. Especially in a randomizer. But in Arcanine. Oh, that'd be so good to have on the team. That would be really good. Anyone else? Please? Oh, the trio. Eh, he's not bad. Especially since he has Arena Trap. But that's not something I want. And am I able to run? I can't escape. No! He doesn't have Arena Trap, though. Uh, run? You're not gonna let me escape now? There, there we go, thank you. Okay, I'm gonna need to heal up. I know I'm level 6, but I'm pretty sure I can take out a Lanoon. I might not be able to. But I have a feeling I can. Especially because I'm going to be lowering the Lanoon's attack down one stage because of my Intimidate. So he's not going to be doing that much. I mean, granted, Tackle does have stab damage, but I think I'm in a good situation right now. I think I can handle it. I think I can handle it. But now the, the real question is, what am I going to give this guy's voice? You got Pokemon at the lab? What a waste. That's a Pokemon that's too good for a wimp like you. Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I do have good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Alright. Red, you want to battle? Oh, Silver, sorry. He's, he's actually really named Silver. Not Red. Red's in Kanto. We can send out the Holy Noon. Alright. Level 5. I don't really like it. I'm going to lower your attack, which is good. I love the battle music, though. This brings back a lot of me uh, memories. Oh, uh, it brings back a lot of memories. I'm going to wrap you right away. Just to get the overtime damage. That was a crit. Okay. Well, never mind. We're not going to be winning this because that was a crit. If it did not crit, we might have had a chance. Even then, I don't think we would. Growl's not going to do that much. I need a poison now. Growl. Please keep, please keep going for Growl. Nope. Oh, he actually did not do that much. Headbutt. He has headbutt? Alright. That's not fair. Hmm. That was a waste of time. Do you want to know who I am? I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. Are you now? Really? Give it back! That's my trainer card! Oh no! You saw my name! Yeah, I sure did. It was, I need to go heal up Ekans. Actually, is Ekans fully healed? Oh. Interesting. So apparently they fully healed the Pokemon. Did not know that. But yeah, so... Actually, Lanoon would have been probably, I would have to say, the better choice for the, at this, like, for the beginning section of this Nuzlocke. Because of the... The fact that he has headbutt. Like, that's gonna be good. Especially because you can uh, headbutt trees and get extra encounters in this game. That would have been really, really nice to have. Eh, I'm not gonna complain, though. You aren't steel just yet. You are psychic, but you don't. You're gonna rap me. But you're gonna rap me? I'm rapping you. How can you be rapping me when I'm rapping you? And you're poison as well. No. J just go down. You're going down right now. I'm not letting you defeat me. There we go. And now, now level 7. But even if I got up to level 7 earlier, I don't think it would have made a huge difference. Because he had, he had headbutt. That stab headbutt. Like, that, that, that does a lot of damage. He can't really just, eat, like, eat that. He, he really can't. Who are you? We are investigating the case of the missing Pokemon here. Rule number one. Whoever did it will come back to the site. Oh my. So, you must be the one who did it? 
No, no, I'm not the one who did it. Hold on a second. He has nothing to do with it. I saw it. There was a red-haired boy looking into the building. What? Really? What? You battled a boy like that? He must be the one who did it. Did you happen to get his name? Uh, what am I gonna name him? Uh, I'm going to nickname him... Roger. The first name that came to mind. No. Roger. There we go. So, Roger, I don't, it, it doesn't look like a Roger though. It really does not, but whatever, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna name him Roger. I wanna get into the action. My next assignment is to search for this red-haired individual. Alright, goodbye, have a good day. See you, man. Thank you, Lyra, by the way. Fish, I'm glad they understood that you are innocent. See you later. That's all she has to say. That's literally all she has to Wow. Okay. Fish, so this is terrible. Oh, yes. What was Mr. Pokemon's big discovery? Uh, it, it was a egg here. There, there, there you go. Huh? Th this is an egg? Isn't it? This egg may be something I've never seen. Still, it's just, it's just an egg. Mr. Pokemon is always fascinated by eggs. Well, since you gave it to us, we might as well find out what secret it holds. I'll keep it for a while to find out about the egg. What? He gave you a Pokedex? Fish, is that true? That's incredible! He's superb at seeing the potential of people as trainers. Wow, Fish, I knew you were a little different. Things are going to be fun. Your Pokemon seem to be really liking you as well. So why don't you take the Pokemon Gym Challenge? If you manage to defeat all the gym leaders, you'll eventually challenge the Pokemon League champion. Or not. <laughs> You're not good enough for that. Becoming a champion is not all, not at all easy. You can certainly challenge Violet City's gym. Fish, challenging the gym scattered around will be a long journey. Before you leave, make sure that you talk to your mom. I don't want to talk to my mom, no. Mom. Mom, I'm leaving. Okay, see you, mom. Bye. Alright. Okay, I'll help too, but what can I do for you? I know, every time you receive prize money, I'll save some of it for you. On a long journey, money's important. Do you want me to save your money for you? Yes. Why? Because I actually heard from someone else that since it is a randomizer, the items that she gives you might also be randomized, so you never know what you might get. Okay, I'll take care of your money. Be careful. Pokemon are your friends. When you work as a team, you can accomplish anything. Now go on. Alright, I need Pokeballs though. I have to go through the, oh, I have to go through the whole Pokeball thing over here. Oh, I don't want to go through this. There you are. Hi, Lyra. Fish, you can catch wild Pokemon with Pokeballs. Follow me. Alright, so this I'm probably just going to fast forward because I really do not want to deal with it at this moment. It's just a waste of time. Just like that. Huh? Was it too fast? I'll try again. Come this way. Alright. Here, this I'm just going to fast forward. Whoa! <laughs> it's, whoa! She's going to be taking on a Snorlax. And she's a Ledian? Okay. So you can encounter a Snorlax in this route. It's gonna be annoying to catch if we do get there. See? Just like that. It's better to lower your target's HP more than I did. Or make it sleep or something. You can try all kinds of things to see what works. I'll give you these. Good luck. So there we go. The Nuzlocke has now officially started. And let's just get into it. See you. Alright, bye Lyra. Alright, so what is our first encounter going to be? So far we have gone nothing. Wow, we've actually gotten nothing. Okay, so our first encounter is going to be a star you. Okay. Uh, I'm not extremely, like, thrilled with that. I don't have much health. Oh boy. Poison Sting, if I get a poison, it's not going to be that great at this point. Tackle does one damage. Solid one damage. Alright, uh, I'm not sure now. He's going to go for Harden, so I can get one more... Poison Sting off, unless I get a Poison. Do not Poison. Please do not Poison. He's still better than no Pokemon. Good, he did not Poison. He's gonna go for Tackle. I'm gonna go for a Pokeball. And I got Staryu. Uh, I think I'm gonna name him Jim. Alright, no, I'm gonna name him Treasure. I think I'm gonna name him Treasure, because, you know, he's like this, the undersea treasure that you find. Or this, yeah, he's like the star shape. Or I could name him Patrick. I'm gonna name him... Mm, cause then he evolves though. He's not gonna be, he's not gonna be Patrick anymore if I evolve him. Anyways, Star you, the star shaped Pokemon. Even if its body is torn, it can regenerate as long as the glowing central core remains intact. I'm gonna name him, I think, Gem. 
Just because, you know, here's a little gem in the middle. Even if he evolves, he's still gonna be he's gonna he's still gonna have that gem. So anyways, there we go. You're gonna name him Gem. He's now part of the team. We're gonna need to do we're, we're gonna need to level him up. But what is his move set currently? He's somewhat stubborn. Well that's not very good. He has increased speed minus defense. Okay. I do not like his ability though. Raises the likelihood of meeting wild Pokemon. That's terrible. That actually is not good at all. Ugh. Alright. We can get another encounter up here. For now, I know I'm going to go heal up. And then I'm going to come back to get that. Just because I really do not want to have anyone die. Especially, like, say we encounter a Snorlax. That Snorlax is going to destroy through our team. Like, it's just going to rip it apart. And I do not really want that to happen at the given moment. And we might buy... I'm going to buy more Pokeballs as well. Now that I'm here, because... I might even, uh, buy, I'm gonna buy Pokeballs and Potions. How much money do I have? 3,000. I'm gonna buy another five, six. Yeah, I'm gonna buy six. There we go. I know if I buy 10, I can get more money. Or more Pokeballs. I'm gonna buy another five Potions. Ah. I'm gonna buy another three. Because it's always better to have them than to not have them. But I think we should be fine for now. I'm going to go back to the route over here. Because we did not get our encounter and I really want that I'm gonna need the apricorn as well so later on we can make some pokeballs if we really choose to do so and let's just go get this encounter now I'm hoping it's a really good Pokemon because Staryu is not Staryu is not that great like it's not a terrible Pokemon but it's not a great Pokemon but anyways the Pokemon here is going to no I'm not getting you that's no <laughs> I feel like I picked the wrong Pokemon now because, yeah, that's that species clause, by the way. So I still get to have another encounter because I'm not gonna be catching a Arbok when I already have a. Hey, seriously, are you the only Pokemon here? When I already have Ekans, like that, that doesn't make any sense at all. I'm gonna be catching a different Pokemon. That's the whole point of randomized is to have a variety of Pokemon, not just one Pokemon as your whole team. Are you kidding me right now? I can't catch this thing. Oh no. I don't think I can catch this thing. Poison Sting. I poison him, which is good. Twister's gonna hurt. Eh, it doesn't, it doesn't hurt that much. I'm gonna go for another Poison Sting. Okay. Alright, I have like one chance to catch him in a Pokeball. He is minus attack. He's poisoned. Let's see. Can I catch him? <laughs> Please. Oh. No. Alright, he's dead. He's dead. I, I, by the way, I had my eyes closed there. I was just listening. I was like, please. Alright, he's gonna be dead. Well, at least Voldemort gets a ton of experience for that. 62? That's it? Alright, well, <laughs> we found a Rayquaza on the second route. You know, that's something. I said I wanted a, a good Pokemon, and we we did get a, uh, a good Pokemon as the encounter. We just... <laughs> Did not get the Pokemon I want. Yeah, Curly would have been nice to get instead of instead of a Staryu, but what can you do? That was our encounter. Staryu might now. Staryu's move set is terrible. Yeah, I'm gonna need TMs for him. I'm going to need TMs. Like if I if I don't get TMs, we're gonna be in trouble because we we need to get TMs for him. And anyways, we're gonna be going to try and get now the third route encounter. Please get Arcanine. Arcanine. Yes! I have my eyes closed there as well. Yes, Arcanine. Okay, so now we're getting you. You have minus attack right now. You have Intimidate as well. So that, that's a good. I like that. Rap. Rap is actually really dangerous. I should not have gone for Rap. Poison Sting, because now you're poisoning the Rap, which will do a lot of damage. Alright, I'm going to just simply throw a Pokeball on him, because I don't know how much Poison Sting will do. I do not want him to kill. One click. Two clicks. Three clicks. Do not play with me. I'm so happy right now. We just got an Arcanine. Oh, that's going to be so good. Arcanine is such a good Pokemon. I didn't... Really? He's a legendary Pokemon? Since when? Like, I know he was supposed to be a legendary Pokemon. But... What? Arcanine, the legendary Pokemon. Its magnificent bark conveys a sense of majesty. Ma okay, anyways. Anyone's hearing it can't help but grovel before it. Uh, I'm gonna name him Doggy. <laughs> Just Doggy. 
completely goes against how he looks. He looks so powerful and so strong to name him Doogie. Doogie. He's my Doogie. But anyways, guys, that is going to be the... Ooh, you have an item as well. Seven, six, five, four, three. All right, please. Two, one. All right, good. Thank you. But anyways, guys, that is going to be the end of the episode here. If you have enjoyed, hit the like button down below or the subscribe button if you love my content in general. And I will see you all next time. Have a great day and good luck.